Hello everyone, welcome back to Drama Fan. So Jay sees Taekang together with his twin. However, Taekang stop Jay from chasing Taesan. In my opinion, Taegang stop Jay from chasing his twin brother is not because he is working together with him, but that is because he wanted to let him live. For all this time, he didn't know if Taesan was alive. That's why he was shocked when he saw Taesan. Taekang won't hurt Jay and will try to chase Taesan. Jay will tell Lee Hwan that Taesan is in the library and it seems he has entered Jay's room. To make Jay and Lee Hwan believe him, Taegang will tell a secret about his past, about his twin, and also where he came from. As we know that Taegang is probably from Byokchon, so based on Taegang's memories, Lee Hwan and Jay will get new information about what really happened in Byokchon 10 years ago. On the other hand, the queen asks to meet Song On. There is her voice who said, she is your betrothed which means she purposely talks about Sundol. And from her information, Sundol is Jay. That's probably the reason she asked to meet him, to let him know that his fiancé is still alive and didn't come to him. Instead, she stays by Lee Hwan's side. The queen wanted to make the ghost letter come true. Your friend will point a sword at your back. Song On is really shocked by that information but he wouldn't immediately believe what the queen had told him. So he returns to his house and looks back at Jay's portrait. The next day, he tries to make sure if Sundal is really Jay. In fact, Sundal has the same face as Jay, which means he is really Jay. That's why Song On's eyes are red. He couldn't believe that she was around him all along and felt betrayed by the fact that she didn't come to find him since she is betrothed to him. Also, his friend Li Huan didn't tell him about Jay. Not only Song On, but the other officials will get a hint about Jay's whereabouts from Wonbo. Because Jay is the key to dethrone the crown prince. Wonbo showed them Jay's wanted poster. However, he only told them that Jay is always by Li Huan's side so it is easy for them to dethrone him anytime they want. Since the crown prince led a woman in the palace as a eunuch, and to add on, she is a criminal. Jay and Li Huan will find another clue. It seems Garam will tell Jay about what she remembers on the day of the accident. Jay's father is drawing something. Jay will tell that to Li Huan, also about the person that ran into Garam which was a judge of Gesong office. That's why Li Huan is trying to visit that person. The person and the drawing that Jay's father drew might give them clues related to the case. At the same time, Jay tries to remember things that happen without her knowledge. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.